Hey guys, what's going on? It's Vic here, back with another Madden 21 video. In today's episode, we're getting back into Niners franchise. And I am aware that some of you guys do not really enjoy the series, but some of you guys really do enjoy the series of simulation style. But I do assume that most of you do enjoy me just playing the game and raging and being infuriated. And I'm not infuriated in this series because, you know, it's not really my fault if the CPU sucks. That's just the CPU's fault. And uh, I know most of you like to see me infuriated, but I kind of like the series because I'm not uh, raging every single episode. But anyways, guys, other than that, we are here to face the division rivals, the Los Angeles Rams. So other than that, guys, let's just hop into it. So first and 10, Richards as the QB throws over the middle to the rookie Philbin, the slot receiver, and that's going to be a first down. First and 10, once again, past the 50-yard line. Richards takes way too much time, throws the ball, fumble. Aaron Donald gets the sack, and the Rams are going to pick it up. First and 10 for Jared Goff and the Rams. Matthew Stafford was not on it at the time. And Javon Kinlaw is going to be in there for the tackle for the loss. And the Rams once again takes the snaps. Jared Goff is having way too much time in the pocket. He finally goes down to Nick Bosa. First and 10 for the Rams once again. Throws over the middle and that is going to be another first down. I believe for the tight end. First and 10 once again for Jared Goff and the Rams. All the time in the world. Bosa's in his X Factor. He still can't get off his block. Now he gets pancaked. Throws over to the sideline. That was complete BS. Should have gotten in there, but still first down. Rams second and nine. Jared Goff looking once again over the middle. It's a slant to, I believe, Robert Woods. First and goal for the Rams, a bunch more slants once again. Running back gets pancaked, and that is going to be a touchdown for Robert Woods as the Rams go up 7-0. 7-0 as the Rams are up, and it looks like Raheem Moster got blown up in the backfield, and that's going to lead to a fourth down. First and 10 for Jared Goff as he is in the red zone with the Rams. Still eight minutes left in the second quarter. Looks over the middle, and that is going to be a nice swat down. First and goal for the Rams once again. Looks over to the side, and that's another great swat down. Second and goal for the Rams after the penalty, and it looks like he's trying to take off, but he's going to get sacked instead. Designed a rushing play. Fourth and goal, the Rams are just going to take their three as they will go up 10-0. 10-0 to zero. Ten to zero as we have the ball back. Second and four, Richards' play action looks over the middle. That is going to be a nice pickup by Debo Samuel, I think. And another passing play, and he's got way too much time. He needs to get rid of that ball. Second sack for Aaron Donald on the day. Second and six. It looks like Fred Warner is in the zone and thrown right above his head, too. That's going to be another first down. Rams on the move, as always. They are playing great. Jared Groff is playing God tier. There's going to be another first down as he gets a weird animation. First and 10 for the Rams once again. Jared Goff is just on a different level. He's got another first down, this time to Van Jefferson as they are rolling. First and 10 once again. I'm going to be saying that this entire time as once again over the middle to Tyler Higby. That's just going to be another first down. It's just too easy for them. Third and goal this time. Finally something different. That's going to be an easy slant route over the middle. Cooper Cup this time on the touchdown as they're going to go up 17-0. 17-0, Niners have the ball. Once again, taking too much time, and here comes Aaron Donald. He needs to get rid of it. And the Rams are back on offense as they are moving the ball. They know what a quick release is. Take notes. Really, Richards really needs to take notes. I, I can't believe I'm saying this, but nope, never mind. Don't take notes on that. Took way too long. Nickel blitz. Second and two, Richards throws over the middle to... Uh, George Kittle, I almost said Kelsey, I'm so stupid, but still, the Niners are here to kick the field goal as they're going to still be down, but it's 3-17 to 17 now. 3-17 to 17 as Goff takes the snap, and he's taking too much time again, I noticed that. Eric Armstead in there for the sack, once again, sack city today. Third and seven, we're looking for another sack if we could. Nope, it looks like Van Jefferson is going to get another first down. Third and eight, Jared Goff taking a lot of time. Throwing to the sideline, Mosses, my defensive back. That's going to be another first down. Fourth and two for the Rams as they're just going to take their field goal here. It is up, and it is good. 20-3 against the Rams. 
20 to three, Richards takes the snap. Looking back, taking too much time. Aaron Donald gets in there for the fourth sack of the day. He holds onto the ball way too long. Fourth and 17, we're gonna need to make something happen here. Throwing over the middle, Debo Samuel breaks the tackle. And that is going to be another first down. Great effort by Debo Samuel. Fourth and one as we are going to take our field goal here as we are going to still be down, but it's going to be 6-20 to against the Rams. And the Rams have the ball once again. Jared Goff taking too much time once again, and he's going to go down. That is going to be Javon Kinlaw in there for his first sack. Second and one as it is going to be play action once again. Heaves over the middle, double coverage, throws to Brandon Ayuk and throws a pick. So we're going to have a quarterback controversy here as we're going to start Jimmy Garoppolo because Richards takes way too much time. He doesn't have a quick release. It's very, very frustrating to watch him. First and 10, pitch to the outside, Cam Akers. He's got great blocks as he bounces it to the outside and is going to get about 17 yards. Second and eight for the Rams as Jared Goff drops back, taking too much time once again. Half a sack for two players. Fourth and 11 for the Rams, actually, as they get the ball back, and it, they are going to doink it off the camera, and that is going to be no good. And once again, Jimmy Garoppolo is here now, thrown over the middle, first reception, and it's going to be a first down. I don't think it was really necessarily a doink off the camera, but we got the ball back once again, and that is going to be Debo Samuel down the sideline. Debo Samuel for the touchdown. Let's go. Jimmy Garoppolo effect in here. And the uh, the Rams get the ball back. I don't know why I'm stuttering so bad. I don't know what's happening. Still, Cam Akers is on the run. He'll see you later. All of our hopes for this game is probably out the window as they go back up to two-possession lead as that really sucks for us. Let's see if the Niners can pull together a final drive. Hopefully they can as Debo Samuel breaks another tackle and gets about 15 yards on the reception. That is going to be another first down. And once again, Jimmy G, second and three. One minute left in the game, taking too much time. Aaron Donald once again. 27 to 13, we really have to piece something together. Aaron Donald in the X Factor, can't get off a block somehow, but that's going to be another first down. And once again, Jimmy G looking over the middle, just taking the check down. That's going to be a 13-yard gain from Marlon Mack. And Jimmy G over the middle, taking too much time once again. This is sixth sack on the day for Aaron Donald. And my phone is buzzing right now. I'm trying not to look at that. Brandon Ayuk over the top completely finesses the defensive back. That is a last-minute score. Doesn't affect the outcome, but it's clear who the better quarterback is. Very, very clear. So Richards, I would say he's a well-balanced quarterback, but for some reason the CPU decides that he holds on to the ball way too much. He doesn't take the checkdowns at all. Jimmy G is clearly the better QB. So if you guys want me to trade away Richards or Jimmy G, you guys just got to let me know. I could trade for Deshaun Watson now, now that the patch has released for the trade updates. So that would definitely be a great thing to see. And also it's not unrealistic if Deshaun Watson goes to the Niners. There has been a bunch of rumors about it. So I honestly wouldn't be surprised. But tell me who you guys want me to start. I honestly like Jimmy G because he is honestly seems like the better player right now. We are one and two. It's not very great, but it is what it is. We have a bye week next week, and then we will be playing the Indianapolis Colts. So anyways, guys, I thank you guys all for watching. Make sure you guys leave me your suggestions down below and tell me how long should I do this series. I'm planning just on one or two seasons. But anyways, guys, that'll be it for this video, and I'll see you guys all in the next one.